Okay, 12 James Thomas, here's an easier way to show you how to do this and sell that technical crap that they're showing you. Okay, boot it up. Hit your boot up. It will load that up. Mine comes up to a dual screen boot. I just hit F8 from there. To diagnose it. There's all of the things. You can last known good configuration that's saying that worked. Enable booting, login, command prompt. Command prompt where you just find the virus. Or safe mode. You want safe mode. So scroll up. Safe mode. Windows XP. It'll go through all its will connect through itself. So just once it goes through everything it'll find all the files it needs to find. <laughs> okay guys. Now it's put in two. Microsoft and it's just booting up it in safe mode <laughs> so now it should bypass if you have a virus on there should but don't hold me against it I should welcome you but <coughs> 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 and then enables you to fix problems I just hit yes if you want to do a system restore it will boot up like this guys it will be in safe mode and then you can find whatever you need that's causing the virus. So, you probably could go and go to command, load up, I don't know how you would do it from there, but that's how you load up a safe command, safe mode. Then I'm just going to hit turn off because I don't need it. So, yeah guys. There you go.